Welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Heroes, Trails of Cold Steel. Last time, we, um... Well, a lot of things happened, so, uh... Actually, no, the practical is the only thing that happened was the practical exam. And today, we're gonna go to Heimdall, so... Let's go. It's gonna be a short trip there, considering it only takes a half an hour. In their town, not mine. Okay. Oh yeah, the summer festival. Festival. There we go. Buy tickets and wait. That's right, Elian and Makis are from Heimdall, so... Should be pretty simple enough. And all of us are going to the same place, so... Everybody will be there. Sort of. That's right, it is capital of uh, Heimdall. Not capital of Erebonia, Heimdall. Don't mind me. Sixteen different di sixteen main districts? Holy crap. Makes sense. Okay. I have a pretty good idea who the um, guide is. All right, let's talk to Elliot. Actually, where we're staying is pretty close to Elliot's place. All right, Laura. I've noticed something in this game. A lot of the, um... 
people, a lot of the people in class seven, you only see their fathers, not their mothers. With the exception of Irene and Elisa, in Reed's case, um, you see both their mother and father. Well, foster mother and father. Adopted mother, mother and father, but you get my point. And Elisa, who you only, you only see well, her mother. Oh, and Fee's case, who, well, she's. Well, a former Jaeger, so you get my point. Now, Machias. Huh. Yeah, it was Gaius last month, and now it was, um, uh, Elian and Machias. Well, you know that you know the deal. I'll play Blade, and I'll be right back. Okay, I am back, so let's stop talking and move on with the story. Twenty minutes later, huh? Dude. I guess that's not the whole point, because, you know, you gotta get the full Heimdall experience. The Heimdall Central Station. This place is pretty, pretty freaking huge. On time. I know that voice. Wait, what? Sup, Claire? Bad. You're from the Railway Military Police, if memory serves me correctly. You're Captain Claire, was it? That's right. I'm glad you remember me. I believe it's been about three months since we last met. So. Oh. This must be the woman the group who went to Keldic encountered. So this is an officer from the fearsome RMP? Um... Since you're here, does that mean you're going to be the one assigning our tasks for this month? No, I'm just here to provide a place for you to talk with the person who is. He should be here any moment now. Oh, here he comes. Oh, and we know the person. It's, well... Perfect timing! You know... You no know way. the familiar face. Machia's father. Dad? Huh. I've seen him in the Imperial Chronicle before. Governor Regnitz, one of the reformists' most influential voices. So this is Machias' father. <laughs> this is the first time I've met most of you, so let me introduce myself. Carl Regnitz. I'm Carl Regnitz, Machias' father. I'm the governor of Heimdall and head of the local government. It's a pleasure to finally meet you, ladies and gentlemen of Class 7. Just remember, there's three board of directors. Guess what? He's the third one. He'll say it soon, and he'll say it like not too long from now, so. It's not like I'm like, uh, spoiling anything. Come to think of it, um,. It's kind of, uh, weird. First you see- first it's, um... 
First is um, Yuzus' brother, uh, Rufus, and then you got uh, Elisa's mother. Now you got Maki's father. Huh. See what I mean? Shocks even Maki us. See what I mean? Also mean. <laughs> Okay, what do we got? And address and key. You know what the place is. Oh, some people will know what the place is. So he's pretty laid back for um, a governor. Well, that's Maki's father for you. I guess we won't see the uh, the request until we actually find our place to stay, which shouldn't be too difficult. Heimdall's pretty freaking huge too. Pretty lively too, when you think about it. Well. I also think about it, it's also the capital, so it makes sense. Oh, off screen, I also did the, uh... Cooking, um, trick, I could say, to get more money. Uh, all you do is, uh, do you, with your first recipe, you, um, make, uh, use, um, Elliot to make a bunch of, uh, um, meals. 
pretty much uh the ingredients you buy with it um cost like 60 Mira but when you make it with uh, uh Elliot you can sell them off for uh, 70 or 80 Mira so you get a 10 or 20 um Mira on profit do 990 that 99 that there you go So my money is pretty by pretty much back up where it should be, sort of. It's not like three hundred thousand that much, but it's around sixty thousand. So I should be good for the for the chapter. And I only get more money as I fight monsters and all that crap. So at least I hope it's gonna be good. Well, we're going our separate ways for now. I forgot this was a long intro to the um in the Heimdall. Yeah, the common point is this street, so... We'll be back here in Cold Steel 3, but we'll be doing the western half. The only thing that comes back from Cold Steel 1 and 2 is the uh, is this street. With the same areas and stuff.
Actually, he's the, uh... We'll meet him in the next chapter, so... Everything should be fine then. Yeah, he's in the 4th Armored Div Div Division, just to, just to get that out of the way. He's the same, he's in the same, yep, there we go, he leads the 4th Armored Division. He's pretty much in the same uh, division as, um, Instructor, uh, Nightheart. Oh, jeez. She's pulling that? The old Bracer Guild. That's right, the Bracer Guild is not exactly prominent in Erebonia. I think the only place that the Bracer Guild is actually around is in La Grem, Lorisome place. Did you notice the question marks on the map when I um, had it up? There, that's the Bracer Guild. They probably did that so he wouldn't give it away. <laughs> I guess we, we don't have to worry about um, food and all that. Former field, uh, former guild branch. See? Can I go in here now? No, I can't. I'm gonna have to wait until we actually um, get our request. Let me think of the name half the time. A big fire that swept to here about two years ago. Um, footnote to that, um, two years ago during the, uh, Trails in the Sky, um, uh, one of the main characters' father, who was that, an S-Class member of the, uh, guild, had to go here and, um, try to fix it. Use key. I don't know why we'd walk away at this point.
There we go. And the ladies are, well, sleeping in the same room. Okay, day one. Okay, underground. Ah, oh, wow, the street required ones. Underground passage monster. Hats off. Oh, we'll figure these out. Right? Chronicles of the Chronicle, as, as in we're going to go to the Cro Imperial Chronicle. As it says. And Amber Amour. Okay. While in Heimdall, you can travel between the areas of the city relevant to the group's field study. To travel, either walk to the end of the area map and press the or press the uh, square button and select one of the destinations listed. Each area has its own has its own tram stop, which you can visit to travel to by tram to other areas. I can't speak. I mean, I always stutter. At certain points in each chapter, you'll need a ride to tram the tram to reach your destination. I didn't have to read that off, but whatever. Let's see. Work through this real study task. Okay. Basically, I'm gonna end it here for today. Next time on Trails of Cold Steel, we are gonna, well, go through our, um, task. So, until then, guys, see you later. <laughs>